Hi, my name is Mark, and we're going to be discussing the internal rotation resisted strength test for the glenohumeral joint for a differentiation out of internal versus external impingement of the shoulder. Uh, this particular test was described by Zaslov in 2001 with a 88% sensitivity and a 96% specificity uh, for determining that internal impingement of the glenohumeral joint. Practitioner will stand behind the patient. Glenohumeral joint will be abducted to 90 degrees, elbow will be flexed to 90 degrees, and externally rotated to 80 degrees. The practitioner is going to apply a force so the patient has to externally rotate into his palm, hold, 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 don't let me push, don't let me push, followed by internal rotation resistance, hold, 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 don't let me pull. Test is considered positive if you're relatively weaker with internal rotation and painful with internal rotation. External rotation will be stronger and less painful. 